Fosters and Smith is the only FFRC box. This one, the other one is, but it's from Marielle, one of the companies that we order things from. But I have not ordered from Marielle in the last week, so I'm kind of curious what's in there. I'm not sure. The movie was good. Very, very, very good. We saw the Act of Valor. Did you see that? Yeah, we saw it last week. We loved it. Anybody that is on our chat that has been in the service for the United States, I want to say thank you. That was a really good movie. It makes you appreciate what our service people do for people. I know Pets has been in the service. Yeah. So it was a very good movie. Oh. My dad was in the Army. My two girls, Christy and Dawn, were in the Navy. Oh, thank you, Mama Three. Your grandson is in the military. Wow. <laughs> now, sometimes your dad was in the Air Force. Yeah, thank you, too, Pat. Yeah, we gotta always remember. I think sometimes, and I'm very guilty of that, is not remembering to thank our service people. So I'm I'm doing that right now. We'll be home on the 27th. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, pets came to my when my dad passed away. He came in. It is uh, to represent the service that he was in. Um, Act of Val Valor, Hellscape. World War II. Wow. Yeah, a lot of, lot of good service people out there. You bet. All right, well, let's. That is correct, Mimi. That's right, Mimi. Yeah, the movie has the real Navy SEALs in it. Yeah. Thank you, guys. All right, well, let's get busy. We have um, one box, but I'll open up Mary Ellen and see what they sent. And check this out. We have a whole bunch of envelopes, and then I'll give you an update on what's going on tomorrow. We have a little change of room. All this stuff that she brought. Yeah, the speedies are here. I call them the speedies. That's <laughs> 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 all right. Mrs. Speedy <laughs> works at. Speedies in the back. 
and Mr. Speedy's back there works at um, Walmart and she got some really good deals for the Rescue Center dog food and cat food I mean litter box toys a ton of stuff so so do we have a do we have a cat at Terry? <laughs> They're saying thank you, Speedy. You're welcome, guys. <laughs> Do we have a cateterry? Oh, Ice Ice Maiden will be cateterry. Okay. Um, Ice, will you Ice Maiden? Would you put on there that we have that wonderful uh, delivery from the Speedy family? And um, there's cat food, dry in can. There's dog lots of canned dog food, which is great because. I would low on that. And cat toys, cat treats, and litter boxes. So thank you. Thank you for adding that. Yeah, we'll fill you in on really all who's going to be going tomorrow because there's a little change on that. But let's do these boxes first. Can I get by here? Mm -hmm. Maybe not. Okay, thank you. I don't know. Speedy and Hey, how did you speak Speedy tonight? Um. Yeah, I'm sure. No. Okay. Alrighty. So ice is gonna be our our cateteri there. Okay. We are ready to go. What's in there, huh, Queen? This one is from Foster Smith, Dr. Foster Smith. That's the company that we've ordered the marshmallow beds before. And we have those white things. You want to play with a couple of those? Something's in here because it's kind of heavy. Hopefully there's a, aha, aha. We do have a paper, lucky end. I know who this is from. This this letter does. Oops, it takes me all right. Here, you want a toy for that problem? You're okay, Tweeny. I did get an email that matches what that says. And this is from D, just the letter D at Lee, L E E. And uh, she ordered a couple of things from Dr. Foster Smith supplies for the kitties. So let's see what she sent to us. We've got a, uh, ooh, what kind of, ooh. I'm always curious. We have a case of canned food here. And it's the Dr. Foster Smith brand. Whoops, don't knock that over, babe. And the first ingredient is chicken, and the second ingredient is chicken liver, and the third ingredient is chicken broth and carrots. Good, good cat food. So we have a case of Dr. Foster Smith's food presented to Connie. You should get a job with what is that price is right? I think they hired me. <laughs> well, oh, I'm gonna save those because I, I always give those Dr. Foster Smith catalogs away and then I end up with not having any. Sometimes I like to look what they have. Ooh. We have uh well actually so there's thirty six cans and okay, I'm not sure what this one is though. <laughs> I've got Stuff all over me. This is a classic country classic dinners, and the first ingredient is salmon, chicken liver, fish broth, then chicken, then shrimp, then brown rice, carrots. Wow, good, good catty cat food, good kitty food. I was gonna say. Oh, it's still on. I'll have to pick one of over there and just talk about some after boxes. Thank you, Connie. And, oh, yeah, I remember seeing this. 
There's a bottle of the Foster Smith Oatmeal Shampoo and an oatmeal conditioner. Thank you, Dee Lee. Thank you. For that, Nora. And what's this one? Oh, this is what you were saying. It's snowing. I want to see what these look like. These are little joint care for cats, soft chewable with glucosamine and chondroitin. I always have trouble pronouncing that. Are you guys leaving? Yeah. Thank you so much. Hello. All right, be careful driving back. Okay. All right, bye bye. Oops. I feel like it's snowing in here. Oh, we'll have to. Do we know where Cutter is? Did he? You want to see if that would be really nice. If, um, or if he's comfortable there, we'll just turn him out. I think he's going You want to see if he'll like that? We'll try that on Cutter Boy. Cutter Butter Boy and see if he likes that. So we got an oatmeal conditioner, oatmeal shampoo, and um, joint care for... Oops. Oh, whoops. Oops. Be careful. Be careful. She had uh, said... She says, I, oh, I just thought of something. If Sheriff Cutter likes those treats, he might... Oh, <laughs> this was cute. He might start arresting the other cats if they go near where you keep the treats. Sheriff Putter needs a sheriff hat and cape. Too bad I can't sew. I'd make one for him. He needs a little sheriff's outfit. <laughs> Cute. Is he going to eat it? Okay. You know, if he doesn't, we'll mix it in with a little baby food and maybe he will. Connie, do you know where these go? In that, yeah, on the left side. I'll set that there for it. I know, there's this. We got white stuff all over us. You know, oh, what else is there? Something else is there. Oh, the hairball remedy. You know, this is the time of year. We, as you guys probably know, we are um, brushing, brushing, brushing to beat the band here. And we're just brushing the cat several times a day. They're actually getting um, grooming. And we're getting a ton of hair out of everybody. And I was thinking the other day, we, whoop. That we should be adding some hairball remedy to their food. So we'll do that in the morning. Thank you, Connie. Appreciate that. So that's from Dee Lee. I'm not sure if she said what state she's from. <laughs> she said the fur, fur ball gel I sent because I heard one of the patty or putter barks. Ooh. <laughs> Reminded me of when my Gracie would do that. So we'll we'll try that. Oh, she's from um, Washington. Cool. Thank you so much, D. Appreciate that. And then <laughs> I think I got that white and does. Oh wait, I'm gonna see what Mary Al sent. I they had another box today that we opened up from Mary Al and as a courtesy, uh, they sent us some heartworm prevention for doggies. So that will be really nice. That will help me because I always have to pay for the my doggie's heartworm. Hi, Mary. How are you? They sent this free. <laughs> the best of stuff. Wow. It's the heartworm for kitties. We don't really worry too much about heartworm too much in this area for cats. Dogs, yes. Kitties, not so much. But it is a little more prevalent than it used to be. And what's nice about this also is, in addition to heartworm disease, it has... It will remove and control infections of heartworms in cats. So these cats all got treatment last month. So we are going to be all set. There's two sizes. Cats 5 to 15. And these must be under 15. 
or under five. <laughs> yeah, I had a pretty good guess because it's either that or over fifteen. I hope my cats aren't too much over that. <laughs> Thank you. That will be very nice, won't it? And then this is Frontline Plus Heart Guard Kitten Kits Inside. Wow, that's very nice, Amiriel. So we, boy, you're gonna fall, Vera. So we got heartworm prevention for the doggies and the kitties. And that's something else we can then add to their their health records. Frontline Plus Heart Guard Kitten Kit. Oh, there's a tag in there that if you put that on your kitty and somebody finds it and you register it, there's a number there that you can hook it up in the computer and find out who that belongs to. Oh boy, I'm just really bad at that. Oh, these are... No, I thought maybe there was frontline in here too. <laughs> are you sure it's not the one with the pill inside? Yeah, the, these are the little individual pill, the heartworm pill. I think that's so, squeeze too, doesn't it? No. Mm -mm. Well, yeah, heartworm and hookworm. But we can give these away. Alrighty. We can give these away in uh there's there's just four of them, but we can give these away in kits. So I don't want these really because well, I mean to go out because these cats better not go outside. Yeah, I'll shake my finger. Do you want to put that in Jimmy's dreams room too? Sure. Cool. Very nice. Yeah, it's over in the toolbox. It's on the, I think the top right door. In our new apartment that we haven't renamed it yet to something. Um, Mary, Mary sewed, and she's going to make the curtains for the walls out there, which... Do you want to see what it's going to look like? Yeah, I would love to see okay. it. This, this is the pillow that's going to... This is the color. Um, colors that's going to be in the, the apartment out there. It will end up being like a very, very nice, comfortable cozy place for people to stay. It's where our clinic used to be, but it's going to be really nice. I can't wait for you guys all to come and share it. Okay, this oh, is the color the curtain's going to be. I love that. And this is going to, the trim is going to be the tie back. That is perfect. You did good, Mary. That's really nice. That's going to be awesome. These will be the tie back? Mm -hmm. The tie back and there's going to be a oh ripple at the top and the bottom. Gosh. Yeah, this is oh, that's perfect. Yes. Do you go to Joanne's for yes. that? Yes. Yes. But I have to measure because I need to order it because it's on sale. So okay. Okay. Um, this um the bedspread for the two beds that's out there uh has this design. Well, it, it might look a little girly, but guys can stay here too. Do mm -hmm. you That's. Do you want me to? Do you I don't think I need that. Okay. Anymore. I'll stick it up here. Yes. That's really a very good. All right, um, match there, Mary. I can go out in there. Yeah, you know the code. Yeah. Okay. Here. All right, and we have a bunch of envelopes. Fair is so cute. She's playing. This is for Fiber Friday, and uh, it's from Kentucky, but let's get a name. I, oh, no wonder I can't use this silly thing. Here, Tweeny, you want to play with that? You still have some cutting power. Enclosed is my check for the Fiber Friday. You guys are my addiction nightly. I get a kick out of that when I hear people say that. I love to watch to see what goes on behind me. <laughs> we we love you all for what you do. You give new meaning to the word dedication. Thank you. Best wishes, Steve and Debbie. So it's Steve and Debbie B. Their web cameras and their cats' names are Callie, Boo, Peaches, and Grace is the company cat. And uh, so Steve and Debbie sent a check um, for Fiber Friday. You know, and you know what is so funny is that a week ago today, 
I didn't even know what a Fiber Friday was. So tomorrow, when um, Steve's going to take all the cats to the vet's office for us, and then he and I will probably go pick them up, and uh, I'm going to pay the bill. I'm going to call ahead of well in the afternoon when they call to give me the updates. I'm going to say get the bill ready. We are paying it. I'm thrilled. And for our catetary, this is Pam Pam S from Illinois, and this is a check for Fiber Friday. Oh, and Pam's Cam name is Bell Time. Bell Time. Um, and rest assured, when we do the, the name drawing, the cards, all these fibers will also be put in there. Are you really having fun, Hetty? This is from Sonja, S-O-N-J-A. I, I know I always misspell that. Remove the white, let's see, the caps always catch my eyes. Remove the white hat is in the box. Cats can get it and throw what what white thing? Okay. Oh wait. Oh, the white. You mean that white stuff? Yeah, it's dissolvable. If they wet, if they get liquid, this is not. Um. Yeah, this is. Here, let me double check. Yeah, this is corn. This isn't styrofoam. It's the uh, dissolvable. See, I just lightly wet it, and it just, it just, it's cornstarch. Yeah, I, I, somebody else had told me that too, CJ. Yeah, it's corn, it's a uh, cornstarch, so we're good. But now that I licked it, I'm gonna throw it away because. <laughs> The kitties will say, I don't want her germs. No, no. Okay. You're okay, big boy. The, oh, this one's for angel kisses. And Sonia is S-O-N-J-A from Canada. S-O-N-J-A. Oh, this is so nice. Oh, I'll put this on Angel Kiss's door. Says, you better yet? Everybody wants you to get well. Some of us are just a little more in your face. Wishes for a speedy recovery, baby girl. Jackie and her team will take the best care of you. Sonia. And this is Cam or um, Son Shamak. I think you've told me like five times how to pronounce that right. And I hope I got it right this time. <laughs> Can you put that on on her door? Thank you. Aw, that's very nice. Does she have any kitties in there with her now again? Oh. Okay, we we have put kitties in there with kit with um angel kisses. Wait, angel kiss has another another card. This is from Connie S. from Ohio, and it's for Angel Kisses. We got another one, Connie. It says, oh, aw, a, a warm hello, and there's a kitty sticking his head up out of the can. It says, sending you warm, happy thoughts and hopes as bright as sunshine. Please feel better. Angel, you were given the perfect name because there are lots of angels watching you. We love you, Tuki. And Connie S. is um, Franklin Cats, and Connie's the one who um, adopted uh, Tukey from us last year. Thank you, Connie and Tukey. Give Tukey a big old hug for me. This one's for Dumpster. It says Dumpster and Jackie. What do you think that is? MP, that's what I thought, but I don't think we have an MP. Um, well, let's just open it up and find out. Oh, 
Connie, can you give Ursula to Emily? Oh, she must not be upset. I stepped, I thought I stepped on a little toy, but maybe not. For Dubster and Jackie. Uh, this is from J. Willie, J. W. I. L. L. I. 667. Says a little cup of magic. <laughs> this St. Patrick's Day may a special rainbow, all your own, shine down on you and bless you always. Dexter, I hope you find a wonderful family. I will miss you when you leave. And that's from J. Willie. And um, they will be calling again. And, oh, and look at these St. Patrick type card stickers. We can use these on our thank you notes this week. And there's a, a donation also, Catetary, if you would put that on there. Uh, and I imagine that's for the Fiber Friday, I would I would bet. When Dexter's family calls, I'll make sure that they know that, that um, Jay Willie sent a card for him too. Yeah, that's really nice. This one is from Teresa T. Teresa with a T-H. Teresa T. from Pennsylvania. Look at that. Find your happy place. Isn't that pretty? And it says... I'm I'm sending this for your kitty's medical expenses. So if our cat is Terry would put that um, Teresa and her cat's name is K C as in the letters K C and Mo M O E and Teresa's chat name is Tweet twenty seven forty two. Thanks, Mary. Tweet twenty seven forty two says I'm sending this for your kit. Kitty's medical expenses. I finally found a job and so happy I can send something to help. Thank you all for all you do. Warm wishes for a speedy recovery for Angel Kisses and Fifi. So thank you. So it, so there's a, um, another Fiber Friday donation to Teresa, who's Tweet, and Casey and Mo. I I gotta tell you guys something. I went a, a lot of you know because I already mentioned this, but I went out to my mom's house today just to just to keep her some company, and um, we we sat down together and we went over all of her birthday cards, and I'm telling you, she was just tickled to pieces that so many people thought of her for her birthday, and she kept saying, and they're from all over. And they took the time to send a card to me, and she just thought that was really cool. So I just wanted to thank everybody who did that for my mom, that you made her very happy. It was really fun to see her be excited. Oh, this is from our friend Mimi in Florida. Mimi in Florida. It says, dropping in to say, aww. Here's a little something to help with the medical bill. So, Catetary, if you could put Mimi um, in Florida is also another Fiber Friday donation. So, here's a little something to help with medical bills at the rescue center. Just wish I could do more. Oh, this, everything you guys give is awesome. Buddy and I are still thanking the Lord for you and your volunteers, webcammers and chatters, and chatters. It's such a blessing to see what dedicated lovers of cats can do. I don't get to check in every day, but try to keep up with the blog. Bless you for all you do, Mimi and Florida, Florida and Buddy the Cat. Thank you, Mimi. I appreciate that very much. Yeah, I'm looking. Oops, that's not. That's a bill. <laughs> oh, I was laughing at Potter. He's is he trying to bury it? Yeah. Putter, putter. This one is... Oh, wait a minute. Didn't we... Oh, yeah. I did. We read this one. This is another one from Teresa. 
T from Pennsylvania. <laughs> not very good with this thing. You're not. Teresa. Oh, thanks, Teresa. Um, coupons. And I'm going to put those up here with the others so I don't forget. Uh, Diane is going to be here on on Wednesday. On Wednesday, and uh, she's gonna she's gonna start the coupon project for us. So thank you for the coupons. Yeah, I'll go through them and pull out the ones that the rescue center can use, and then um, we're gonna give have the volunteers see if there's any that they can use. This is from Carso, C-A-R-S-O. Wow. Oh man. I just don't have a knack of this thing at all. <laughs> There's a piece of tape there that's keeping me from what I need to do there. <laughs> says here is a fiver thank you for all you all do love watching your cam and chatting sometimes too I have been watching over a year and wish you continued success what you do for the kitties and kitties everywhere thanks again and this is Carso C-A-R-S-O 14 and Carso 14 is on right now thank you very very much I appreciate that we'll, we'll make you up a card too and put you in the drawing for the pictures. Thank you. So nice of you guys. You guys must have, these fibers today must have sent these out on Friday. Oh, this is, this is another bill. This is one of our vet bills. And uh, this is the one that took my breath away last week <laughs> when I started panicking. <laughs> We're just going to shove that down in there and not look at that until later. Gail, G-A-I-L-J from California. You know, that's pretty quick postal service, isn't it? Oh, this is Peppy Le Pew. Gail is Peppy Le Pew says for medical fund so so Kataterry if you could put that this is also uh, um, a Fiverr Friday I don't need a thank you card just a, just an email that you got the cash carry on from Pepe Le Pew um, oh in her email address uh, it starts with F-I-F-I -F -I, Fifi and she says haha I have had the Fifi Addy for about five years now aww Thank you very much, Pepe Le Pew. Hey, now who's doing that? Come on. Who is that? Oh, you're okay. You're quite fine. I'm glad you're out. This is Janet, or Jan, Jan from Connecticut. Hi, Izzy. What are you doing? Are you are you strolling around? Did your mommy come and visit you today? This is um, Kataterry friend. If you could put Jam from Connecticut um, has a Fiber Friday donation. Oh, we're going to have to come up with a new total. Well, wait, some of these I already have because um, some of these people emailed me and told me that it was coming, so I added some of these already. Gloria C. from Michigan. Vera, you could probably do a better job than me. So, Gloria... Gloria C. from Michigan, and this is also a, a Fiber Friday. 
<laughs> oh my. This is another fiber. Oh, this is Lou Beth, L E W B E T H from Massachusetts. Says just a little note that I've enclosed two checks. Oh, one from me, Lou Beth, and one for my faithful looking roommate, Betsy. Um, yeah, see, these two I know we added into the amount. So on our category, if you could put Lou Beth for Fiber Friday and also Betsy P. And also from Binks the Cat and Chloe the Dog. Thank you, Lou Beth and Betsy. <laughs> my, my mom didn't know that we were doing the Fiber Friday. So I was explaining it to her today and how awesome um, the results were. And she was just astounded. And she said, but how do you get the money? How do you know that you got the money? And I was trying to explain PayPal to her. you got to remember, my mom has never even put a finger on a computer. And she didn't quite understand how that cyberspace bank could be out there. And uh, she thought that was very, very interesting how that could be. And she was, she was just blown away too. She just kept saying, "Are you sure? Are you sure that that's what it added up to?" And she just said, "She and I both had fun together today." This is from Patricia M. Patricia M. from Illinois. Oh, check this kitty out. And Patricia says, here is my contribution for Fiber Friday. And this is in honor of her three cats, Cleo, Baby, and Smiley. I will have to share a story about Smiley one day. He's quite the boy, quite the cat, fellow cat lover in Illinois. So for our cat I know I'm throwing a lot of names out to you, but um, Patricia M. in Illinois and her kitties are... Cleo, Baby, and Smiley. And Pat, if you're on, I'd love the story of Smiley. I love, uh, e just email it to me if you'd like. I'd, I'd love to read it. Uh, this is from Deborah B. from Florida. And then we have one more. Deborah B. from Florida. Oh, this is nice. We got some more coupons. And it says, I totally, oh, I, I admire your work in the center. Please use this this donation in any way you see fit. And um, I think we'll just put this towards our medical thing, too. We'll put this for our Fiber Friday because um, the kitties, our, our spay bills and neuter bills are going up this year, which was also my concern. So Deborah B. <clears throat> is a Fiber Friday. The came does not like where I'm sitting. Uh-oh. I only have one more. Then I'll move. Uh, this one's from Mike B. Oh, this is from Mark Center in Ohio. This is just down the road a little ways. Mike B. from Ohio says, here is our donation for the new storage room. And again, if we could have another leaf on the giving tree, we would like it to say, and then he's got his name. Also, if it wouldn't be too much trouble, could you put it next to, yes, we will do that. Um, these folks have donated a leaf uh, just Last week, I think it was, and it's going to say, In Loving Memory of Patches. And if, Mike, if you and you're in Sharon are watching, I will order this one tomorrow, and we will be happy to put these two leaves together. So thank you, Mike and Sharon. I appreciate that. I'll, uh, I'll get the order for the leaf in, in tomorrow. 
So, and now that it's warm weather, we'll be put, well, kind of warm weather, uh, we'll be putting those leaves up real soon. So, um, that's it for right now. Oh, so we've got a few updates to do. And um, I better put the coupons away. So tomorrow is a big, big, busy day here for us and the kitties. Um, the three kitties you already know about are going to go. Uh, uh, Fifi, who's right there, she's going to go for her eye surgery. And the first one is the entropion surgery. And in case you don't know what that is, I'm, we probably have talked about it, but her eyes, you know, are sunk so far back in her head. And, and since there's no muscle to push those eyeballs out where they're supposed to be, the eyelashes have curled inside. Um, and the, the, the hair, the eyelashes, are touching and rubbing somewhat on the eye. And that can cause scarring, which will diminish her, her sight. So what they do is cut up above the eye and lower the eye, take some skin out, so then it, it's kind of like an eye, eye tuck, I guess, so that it pulls the eye lashes out farther so the, the um, edges of the hair isn't touching the, the eyeball. The other problem that we're having with her is uh, her third eyelid. You know, a lot of times when cats are sick, uh, you can always tell something's coming up because that third eyelid that's in here raises up here and you can see it. It's kind of white. But on her, her third eyelid is up all the time. And that's because, again, the eyeballs aren't out far enough to keep the eye, that third eyelid receded in where it's supposed to. So um, we, we uh, I'm hoping that they'll go ahead and do that surgery too and pull that third eyelid down because as it is right now that third eyelid is up so high it's actually covering half of her visual view so but on the other hand the good thing about that right now is it's also protecting the eyeball but once they get that that um, eye eyelashes pulled up then we don't need that third lid uh, to be protecting the eyeball so hopefully they'll do both procedures tomorrow and then um, Jaken and Gina are going to go up for their x-rays. And they, they won't need a, any sedation for that. And it's just to see if there's any progression of their heart disease. And if, oh, I hope, I hope, I hope they can get an EKG of Gina. I really feel um, before we can put them up for adoption, I would love to not only have the second set of x-rays to have a little more feel on that, um, but to also uh, get that EKG on Jaina. She, she was such a little ornery twerp last night time that they couldn't get the EKG done. So I'm hoping I'll, t I'll have a talk with her in the morning and maybe she'll, she'll let them do that. And then we are also going to have uh, Snuzzle have her spay. They had room enough in there to get uh, Snuzzle spay done. So because, you know, she's on hold. And then that way we can get her adopted out soon, too. I did hear from the lady, the family that wants to adopt in McAllen. They're very excited about it. They're going to be coming to visit McAllen and all the kitties this week sometime. And But they also have a vacation coming up. So they're going to wait till after their vacation to uh, officially adopt McAllen. Uh, trying to think. Angel Kisses is doing good. She's We've been putting kitties in there off and on all day for her to have somebody to, other cats for her to uh, stay in close contact with. We don't want her to be secluded in there. And Promise was in there playing. Uh, Angel Kid Kisses hasn't really played yet. She just lays there and kind of watches everything. But I know she's enjoying the other kitties. So... Uh, and it was nice to see Promise playing in there because Angel Kisses was entertained with that. Who's all going tomorrow? Jaina, J Jaken, um, Fifi, and um, Snoozles, Nuzzle, Snuzzles. The kitty that meowed all night, that was Tweedy with a D. 
is the door is open to their room now. So they're out and about. Um, Dappa, he's actually right there. He's a big boy. Oh, boy, today. Uh, him and um, Raleigh, or I always want to call him Raleigh. Uh, Rory was in the hallway. And, you know, well, they were really checking each other out like, I'm bigger and badder than you or whatever. But they, they kind of parted ways and they, they did really well. Uh, and then Mimi, the, the mommy, is also out. And Izzy's way up top right now watching us. And the one kitty, though, uh, Missy, I did put back in Thumper's room. She is just petrified of being out here. And it wasn't fair to her to make her, you know, try to, she just wasn't happy. And it's not fair to push our ideas onto her. So I put her back in Thumper's room. She's much happier and quieter back there. She just was pretty scared. This is just was too much for her. So, oh, and did, did anybody happen to see the picture of Badu, the pencil sketching? that uh, Dorothy Y in California did. I'm not sure if anybody saw that. But uh, thanks to Nika Ross, she took this gorgeous picture of Badu and then Dorothy Y. I'll go get it. Dorothy Y in California, I think she said she pencil sketched it. Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? I mean, I just, I thought it was breathtaking. And she, she, this is a picture that Badu, or of a picture, Badu took, <laughs> no, Nika Ross took of Badu. And then I think that Dorothy does the pencil etching. I just think she has beautiful talent. Uh, I'd like to copy it. I just copied it off onto regular paper for right now, but I'd like to actually copy it onto photograph paper and, and frame that. Here, yeah, Badu. Whoops, you were just right here. Um, I think that that's all that I have. Did anybody have any questions? Yes, the Canton. Yes, this is the same Dorothy that um, called me a long time ago when Farrah was having a seizure down there by where the purple rug is. She called me. First time that I think anybody actually had called me to say something was wrong out here. And I was so thankful. Yeah, I run, ran out here. And there was Farrah. Most of Farrah's seizures she happened to have on, on cam. It is. It's a, it's a gorgeous picture. Uh, Farrah's had her meds. Yep, thank you. Yep, we live on a in the rural area, and we've got barns and animals outside. It, oh, I'm doing good, CJ. I'm ready to go to bed tonight, though. Um, first off, let me tell you about Jacob's tail. You know, the first time we measured it, it was 11 inches, and then the week after we measured it, it was um, 11 and a half. Last week we measured it, and it was 12. And today somebody asked about it, and I said, well, I thought it was still 11 and a half, but then I forgot it was 12. So we ended up measuring it again. It's 12 and a half inches long. And I wrote that on her his papers that goes with them tomorrow so they, they can check it out. 12 and, 12, inches, 12 and a half inches. Now, feet, Kriya <laughs> Badu. Uh, well, I don't think she's scared of the other kitties. I think she just likes to be queen over them. Badu had been owned by a young girl and was a house kitty. Couldn't keep her because she got a job out of the state, gave Badu to her parents who had her inside for a while, and they really didn't want the hair business. So they have a what they told me was a nice barn and stall, so they put her in a stall. And 
that's where she stayed until they called and we could take her. So, um, so she had a few mats when she came. The camps. Mamie, I did get a card from you, but I wasn't sure um, if I was supposed to open it. Wasn't it strategic management? Am I, um, Mimi, let me know if I'm supposed to open this now or what. I'll try to find snoozles. No, I haven't heard from Warren for a while, Mr. Baker. But that means, you know, after the initial adoption calls that, that things are going good. I'll see if I can show you the new kitties. No, I haven't heard from Wiggles Jeepers, but we did hear from Shasta, and Shasta's doing great. Have you seen it gorgeous in person on a frame? You mean Baju's picture? That's I, if you're talking about Baju's picture, I I really would love to frame it. <laughs> maybe maybe Jake and body's getting smaller. I like that. <laughs> oh, and you can tell I'm way behind here. Oh, that would be interesting to wit. Oh, Dawn, I can't send a free shirt. I'm so sorry. Jen, are you asking me if I got the pictures? Um, Sophie and Lucy, you asked about Badu. I'm hoping somewhere, somehow, someone out there will want to be able to have her but uh she's one girl that i will be very careful i don't i would prefer not to go into a home without any kids or frequent visiting kids and other cats i Jen, am I, was I supposed to pick up the pictures? Jen, Jen, was I supposed to pick up the pictures? Oh dear, I, or did you drop them off and I haven't seen them? Oh, tell me, tell me, Jen. And Mamie, I, Mamie, did you answer me? I'm, I might have missed that too. Mamie, can you let me know if on um, the card... from um, strategic management that was yours oh skeetikin on my desk oh well let me go look you guys you're so cute Oh, Jenny, these are great. You guys want to see these? Yeah, their shirts on. That's right, on um, Cafe Press. These are the pictures we're going to use for uh, the drawing for the fiber fry. Fiber, fiber fry. I can tell when I'm tired. I start slurring my words. Um, this is our beautiful twinkles, and we will do the paw prints. We're going to do these tomorrow. Jenny, I'm so glad you brought these because. Uh, Judy S. is coming tonight, tomorrow, and we're going to um, do the paw prints then tomorrow. I mean, check out those eyes. They're so green. A moody shaling canton. 
Will somebody keep track? I might miss uh, Mimi's answer. And this is Bella. And I know the lighting is horrible on these right now. Let's see if that helps a little bit. Oh, in a different pose of Bella. <laughs> no, we're we're gonna do them in front of the cam. Oh, our buddy boy Putter. That help or does uh, no? Sorry, Mamie. Okay, and Mamie, do you want me to open that now, or am I supposed to open that now? I wasn't sure what was going on. Oh, Asha. Jenny, you took good pictures. Oh, my, or, uh, yeah, magenta. <laughs> oh, and cutie. You know, cutie's, oh boy. Cutie's been a hard cat. Boy, I know that light and these are glossy so I'm sorry cutie's a hard girl to sometimes get a picture of okay no problem do it oh that's a good picture too and believe me they're way better than what you guys are seeing them because I know I'm getting a lot of bounce on there She is. Oh, and Patty, but I see we wash his eyes like three times a day, and I see we still have bookies in his eyes. Okay, Mimi, I will. <gasps> oh, there's the Badu. Yeah, let me think. Let me uh, talk to Jenny about that. Okay, I will. Oh, closer to me. Will that help? Oh, that that is better, isn't it? She's she's beautiful. I love her. Oh, and you guys know who that is. Well, especially if they they've ever have had like the. Um, you know, the infection in the eyes, that Khaleesi, or not the Khaleesi virus, but the, the herpes virus in the eyes, they can sometimes carry that for quite a long time. And I have, myself, I have one cat in the house. She constantly has a, has a weepy eye. We, and, you know, sometimes too it can be, um, tear ducts can also be blocked also. Isn't he just gorgeous, our boy? Now, putter butter. Oh, twinkles. There's a different one of Ada Jane. <laughs> oh, and oh, and there's Diff Diffy. Wheezy's eye. Do you have Wheezy on uh, Lysine, Leany? There's Taurine. Oh, you. How's that? Yeah, and that's, yeah, that's right, Persians, you know, they have as long a nose as um, a regular cat, but it's all shoved in there, including the tear ducts. And our Dugster, and all three of them are doing wonderful. Another different pose of Badu. Whoops. And... I think this is the long tail boy, Jaken. Okay, so Jenny, are these all four 
the the drawing thing. <laughs> oh, you think it was Zelda? Oh, maybe it was. I should have looked better. Oh, it is. <laughs> I'm sorry, Zelda, Zelda. It is. This one is Zelda. <laughs> yeah, whose tail is no longer a foot. <laughs> okay. Well, Jenny, we'll we'll get working on these then tomorrow. That's always fun doing the paw o graph. Sometimes we make a right mess of it. So Mimi, I have your card. I will go ahead and open that then. Hi, Emmy. Oh, ah, check that out. Isn't that cute? Look at that hat. I'll bet you Bella wishes she had a crown like that. <laughs> oh, Mamie. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it says, with the right hat, they'll never notice the whiskers. Happy birthday. <laughs> Mamie, you're a rascal. It's a <laughs> it says, this is actually just for anyone who happens to have a birthday in March, like Georgia, Raza, or Cyrilla, or anybody else for that matter. Love Mimi. Uh, Mimi, you are indeed a rascal. Thank you, Mimi. We have lots of March birthdays here. Okay. All right. I got to tell you what I heard today. I heard that that my birth date was put on Facebook. <laughs> Do you know anything about that? <laughs> no, but I read something once. Yeah. <laughs> um, I, I was I trying... I will tell you who the culprit is. <laughs> who is it? <gasps> Steve told? Shh. Who did he tell? That's what, that's what I read. Oh, man. He's in big trouble. Okay. Putter did that? I mean, I mean, Steve Riddle did that? Somebody I read asked. that somewhere. Oh, he's in deep doo-doo. <laughs> okay, this is the reason that I was trying to be hush-hush about my birthday. Oh, you guys really are naughty. But this is the... <laughs> yeah, Pets, did you do that? You're going to be in trouble, too. This is the reason I was trying to be quiet about my birthday. There is a real good reason. Um, and that's because... Um, you guys do so much for this rescue center that I didn't want to, you guys to think you should or would or needed to do something for my birthday. I don't know how to say it, but to say it like that. Um, I just didn't want you guys to, anybody to make a fuss because you guys all do so much for this rescue center. You do a lot. And I don't know where we would be without you guys' help. And I didn't, I, I never like to ask for things. And, you know, like that Friday thing, Fiber Friday was the first thing that I had ever asked maybe to have help with. <laughs> and uh, so, I don't know. That's hard for me. <laughs> so that's why. That's why I, I was just trying to, not let anybody know where it, when it was because I don't want you guys to make a fuss. You do enough enough wonderful things for the rescue center, and that's that's all I ask for is that support for the rescue center. <laughs> you guys can sing happy birthday. That's all. I haven't seen it which Facebook it was page but all I heard was that it was on there I know and you guys do show your appreciation by by being here with us by all the things you do the voting for us the gifts you send just your encouraging words just being here <laughs> 
No, I'm not going to be 21. I wouldn't want to be 21 again. <laughs> oh, yeah. I even took it off of my Facebook so nobody would see it. <laughs> well, you all do so much for, for us. <laughs> You've known for weeks. I'm going to go in there and talk to that, Stephen. I'm going to find out who did it. I think you did. I swear I read Maybe it Maybe it was Pets. Pets, you're in trouble then. Didn't you read it somewhere, you guys? <laughs> Let me look. <laughs> Didn't I read it somewhere on there? What was it? It was for the chatters or for somewhere it was on there. All right, somebody going to back me here? <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I'm behind, so let me catch up. I think he's behind. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's it. Jody's birthday is the day after mine. When will apartment be ready? Well, um, we're starting the painting this week. Well, I tried to get that. Thank you, guys. <laughs> See if I hold a chicken for you guys today. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. See, if, see if you'll bring a chicken in here again, huh? Connie, that was so funny. <coughs> <laughs> yeah, that's Steven. He's in major trouble. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Better not been Paul. I'll, I'll. Oh, you know what? Oh, God darn! I can't think of the name. Oh shoot! I try, was gonna try to remember that, but Mom and I had a good chuckle on Mom's birthday cards today. Uh, you know how my mom does this all of the time to my son, Sam. You know, come here, Sam, come here. I want to have something fun to tell you. And then she, you know, smacks him on the hand, the arm just as a fun thing. And, and she's always doing that to Paul, too. Come here, Paul. I have something to tell you. And she'll smack him on the arm. And she did that here a uh, while ago. And some of you web gamers saw that. And mama, mama was all, my mom has always done that to Paul. And uh, one of the birthday cards said, something about um to call paul over and smack him once so i thought that mom got such a big kick out of that <laughs> yeah well you guys are rascals and connie isn't to blame either it was one of my sisters <gasps> and pinky has holy moly you guys are probably my dogs told you too then i'll bet you Okay, well, you guys are awesome, and uh, I so appreciate everything you do for us. <laughs> One of my sisters, oh my gosh, my sister Patty's in, uh, uh, gosh, where is she now? Um, where did I say she was going? No, not mine, or, uh, <sighs> I was trying to think of the name of the town. Can't, can't think of the name of the town. She's got interviews this week and next week. And uh, <laughs> it was Cammy. Oh, well, Reinhardt, happy upcoming birthday. Hey, and tomorrow is, uh, while well, we're telling you all these things. Yeah, Oregon. I was trying to think of the name of the, the town that it was in. Nope, that's Preakness. Um... Tomorrow is uh, Lorraine's birthday. So, Karen only innocent per yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, well I'm going to clean up here and I thank you guys all so very much for being a part of this rescue center, for helping us and just being here with us. When I was opening up, or when I was reading through all of my mom's, Chris, my, her birthday cards today, I knew almost every single one of the names, and it was so nice to to uh, realize how many good friends we have through this webcam. Okay, I'm going to reboot for you all, and if there's a problem on the cam tonight, just have one of the moderators call. That'll be fine. And our moderators tonight is Camp and Cat, Dawnstar, Gemini, Tommy, Jan. Is Jenna a moderator tonight? Love my pets, Mamie. Wait a minute. Oh, I see what happened. Yeah, Mamie, Napa, and your bet. You guys are all blue. You're all welcome. Hey, 
Connie. Yes, sir. When is your birthday? A long time. I know. I'm. Oh. Actually, yeah. When is it? I did write it down. So now I'm not holding anybody's secrets anymore. I'm going to tell you. I didn't. I, I told you these people. Yeah. I read the told. Yeah. Myself, I didn't need told because I already knew. Jody's birthday is the 22nd. Yes, it is. Yes. Let's find Connie. I didn't Connie. know that either. You guys all going to get a pencil and paper? I'll tell you when Connie That's is. That's not. It's a long, long time from now. Yeah, it is a little ways, isn't it? Yes, it is. But we can find it. <laughs> uh oh. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh. Yeah. It's the same day as Greg's. Who's who's gonna be blue forever? Whoa. whoa. I miss it. Oh Jen. <laughs> um, it's can I tell him, Connie? I won't tell him if you tell me no. You are such a liar. <laughs> 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 I won't tell him, but I'll show him. <laughs> it's November tenth. <laughs> I did. I just pointed it out, honey. Gee, thanks. It's a long time away. <laughs> and it's guys. Greg's birthday that day, day too. So we got a blue gin today, huh? I'm not sure, Mamie. I don't. I've got all the volunteers' birthdays in here, though. <laughs> Is that your birthday too, Brits? Well, way to go. <laughs> oh, that promise. Okay, I'm gonna clean up and get get uh get inside. <laughs> yeah, we ought to just go down the line and tell everybody you have to tell us your birthday. Uh oh, I lost mine. It was a special clip. Oh, I just put it up. Oh, you did? Okay, it's a it's a good holding one. Are you doing that? Are you needing? Huh? Are you needing? Well, that sure is nice of Muriel, isn't it? Since we got two two boxes of. Oops. Oh, oh, I almost forgot this. Phew. I almost forgot. I'm so glad I looked at that. I have um, something I'm supposed to read on Monday, which is today. Um, a webcam friend. Uh, her cam name is Danaz. D-O-N-E-Z. Um, she... She had donated some money for um, Fiber Friday, and it was in memory of her precious Lightning, who passed away, I believe, that day. And she also sent, oh, and the, the donation was equal to the vet bill, and then also in honor of Lightning. And... She did send a picture of lightning, which I wanted to share. It's kind of small, but I think you can see how pretty. And she had written this, I believe, before she had went. And then when she got back, she said that um, she sent another donation. And that it had been especially meaningful days. And that he had suffered from diabetes for several years and been in failing health lately. And I can see in his eyes that he is suffering. Wow, what a hard decision. Please give all your kitties an extra hug and kiss for me. I love what you do. You are all very special. And I thank you for everything you do. And um, to please pray for her baby. It's so hard to lose our kitties and cats and... And she has these. Listen to her. The ages of her other other kitties. She has seven other kitties, and one is Brianna, age seven. And the rest of these are. She's got a lot of older kitties. Kylie is twelve. Shiloh is sixteen. Freckles is sixteen. Cinnamon is sixteen. 
Thunder is 17, and Shantae is 18. Isn't that something? A lot of six six out of those seven are are oldies, are oldsters. You know, I just think there's these oldster cats are um, just really extra special. I I know it's hard because we know they're they're not going to live forever, and uh, but they always seem to me they seem so dignified, and I just I just think oldsters are pretty cool cats. We've been a little worried about our one of our oldsters, um, Twinkle, Twinkle Winkle, our Twinks girl. She's just not been um, eating real good. She doesn't act like she feels bad at all, but her appetite has definitely decreased. And it's one of the things that we look for. So we just love her. <laughs> yeah, I'm still yakking away while. I know there's just something real regal about older cats. I think so. Thank you for sharing that that with us. All right, and we better leave pictures out where I can find them. Now I remember. I'm gonna try her again. Isn't that just beautiful, though? Yeah. Oh. Even the man, all cats are drawing. And so she drew it. If not the picture, wow. I think it's pencil etched. Heck of a job. Yeah, I think it's beautiful. It is beautiful. And so I don't forget, somebody wanted to see snoozle or nuzzle. Snuzzle. I always have to say nuzzle, then I get it right. This is snuzzles. <laughs> She's an ornery little stinker. I said, he's not an orangey little girl. Oh, now you're going to be all cool and, cool and calm. Oh, she's going to go play. Promise is over there playing. Hi, Bella. Hi, Dappa. Hi. <laughs> he's a kisser boy. Did you can see the kitty? Oh, he says I just love that head puff. Oh. Oh, you're just a baby. You're a big boy. Yeah. I love his toes. He's got little, like he's been walking in the sugar bowl. Yeah. yeah. You're doing really good, you know, for just being in your or out of your room for twelve hours. She's not gonna eat it. You know, I don't know if we've tried baby food with her lately. I tried. Did you? Yeah, yes, but that was yesterday, not today. Oh. <laughs> I set Dapa down and he just falls over. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to think of which cat was in there. I was petting him, and there was a, one of them, maybe it was Tween, and he hissed at her. And and I just touched him to start petting him, and he hissed like, oh. at the same time he rolled over and showed his belly, like, okay, never mind. Yeah, I didn't really mean that. <laughs> and this is Mimi. Mimi has the white face. This is the mama. <coughs> She's really a nice girl too. She'll she'll come and come to you to be petted. Ah, and tomorrow we're gonna trim their nails. Yeah, she's kind of like a Kiara. Oh, you are way too cute, baby girl. All right, let's see if we can find your your girl. Who's your girl? Hi, Zelda. What's 
I played that song today, that Lean on Me, that card so many times I wore it. I think I wore the battery out. Here's Fifi. Fifi says, I got to get all spruced up tonight. We trimmed her ears. Or no, we didn't. We trimmed her nails and cleaned her ears. All the caps that go up for surgeries or go somewhere, I always make sure we double check those things so everybody knows we take good care of our babies. Yep. Okay, I'm going to do really good tomorrow. She's such a sweetheart. I love to see her get after Jaina. Yep, see, I'm all ready. I'm going to have my bath tonight. And I don't know where Tweety is. Um, she's probably laying down sleeping somewhere. Oh, stop. You're all right. Uh -uh. Oh, that's not nice. You don't do that. You just get done seeing how sweet somebody is, and they go, that's quite a goose. All right. Well, thanks everybody for everything. You all are pretty special to us here. Thank you so much. And tomorrow we will keep you all informed as um, we get calls back from the surgeries and X-rays and everything. We'll we'll keep you guys informed as soon as I know. And we'll do the photographs tomorrow. And I'll double check the checks that we got today to make sure we got cards for them. <laughs> Promise just fell down the steps doesn't bother her and then we'll be doing the drawing maybe Wednesday but I'll set up a time so everybody knows okay all right thanks everybody oops reboot 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 no maybe I don't oh well, the only ones I bathe is uh are the sphinx kitties but I after they've had their initial bath here we don't do it again unless they got you know potty on them or something but yep other than that we don't they do a darn good job doing it themselves yes hello kitty actually I had oops it got moved again okay I want to just make sure we take that with with PP tomorrow oh, the blanket. um well the blanket is really big I was going to do the Fifi or her um the little stuff one there it is right there on top Mm -hmm. Yep, we'll take that with her tomorrow. Open it up here.